this isn't gonna work. This is not working for me. I really thought I wanted a peachy pink, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna change plans. I'll get back to you in a moment. Welcome to another episode of our furniture flipping adventure. And as you saw, this piece is gonna take a few twists and turns before we finally get her to her finished end place. But until then, let me introduce you to this cute little drop front desk that I found. To start off with, I'm gonna get this piece nice and clean. That's always my first order of operation. After getting her all cleaned up, I'm gonna work on taking off the handles as well as that lock plate on top. I flung one of those little nails off of it when I was loosening it and I actually managed to save it, which is good because I don't have any of those tiny nails laying around. I'm going to be spraying over this entire desk with some shellac, which will help block in any natural occurring oils or tannins from the wood so that when I paint over it, they don't seep through that paint and discolor it. And this is where things started to go wrong. I really felt like I wanted to do something really fun and bright with this desk and try something new. So I dumped a bunch of pink into a little bit of orange to kind of get a corally peachy color. And I didn't fiddle with the color enough and test it out enough to know what it was really going to do. And as I started painting it on, I realized this was not the shade or the look I was going for. This isn't gonna work. I have a motto now when it comes to painting. When in doubt or in trouble, paint it blue. It always works. I will keep this paint and tweak it some more and use it on a different project, but it was not jiving with this one. For the front panel, I kind of wanted a blended look, so at first I mixed my paint halfway with white to give myself a middle color and then was going to do the center white for a soft blended look. And once I laid that out over the first coat and let it dry, I decided I was just going to add white to the middle and kind of blend it out gradually, adding a little more until I got more of just a very soft glow into the center rather than a blend from one color to another.
I hope you enjoyed this makeover as much as I did in the end. <laughs> Let me know what you think of my wild idea of painting something in a crazy orangey pink color. And let me know what you think that project should be. I have a few ideas in my stash, but I'm still not quite sure about it. I'd really appreciate it if you'd hit that like button, and subscribe if you haven't already, and leave me a comment down below. I respond to all the comments as soon as I read them. Until next time, I'm Sarah with our furniture flipping adventure. Goodbye for now.